Is your Fetch TV box stuck during a software update? This is a common issue with several straightforward solutions. First, be patient. Software updates can take anywhere from 10 to 30 minutes to complete. Allow the process to finish naturally before trying other solutions. Next, ensure you have a stable internet connection. You need at least three megabits per second download speed. Test your connection with another device and disable any VPN that might interfere. Try power cycling your Fetch TV box. Unplug the power cable, wait a full minute, then plug it back in. This simple reset resolves many update issues by clearing temporary glitches. Finally, inspect all cable connections. Ensure HDMI and antenna cables are securely connected and undamaged. Loose connections can interrupt the update process and cause it to hang. If these basic troubleshooting steps don't resolve your stuck update, don't worry. More advanced solutions, including factory resets and hardware checks, are covered in the next section. When basic troubleshooting doesn't resolve your Fetch TV update issue, we need to move to more advanced solutions. These methods are more powerful, but require careful attention to avoid data loss. First, try a soft reset by power cycling your Fetch TV box. Unplug it for one minute, then reconnect. This simple step resolves many update issues without losing your data. If the soft reset doesn't work, you'll need a factory reset. However, this is a serious step that will completely erase all your recordings, settings, and personal data from the device. To perform a factory reset, you'll use the colored buttons on your Fetch TV remote control. Here's the exact sequence you need to follow. Here's the complete factory reset procedure. First, power off your Fetch TV box completely. Wait 30 seconds for all components to fully shut down. Then power the box back on and wait for it to start up. The critical step is the button sequence. Press the colored buttons on your remote in this exact order. Blue, then yellow, then green, and finally red. This sequence must be pressed after the box has powered on. To prevent future update issues, follow these important tips. Never use VPNs or proxy servers during software updates, as they can interfere with the download process and cause the update to fail or get stuck. Always ensure you have a stable internet connection with at least three megabits per second download speed. Unstable connections are a common cause of failed updates. Keep your Fetch TV software updated to the latest version. Recent releases like version 4.5, Flinders Bay include important bug fixes and stability improvements that prevent update issues. Fetch TV continues to improve their platform with regular software updates. The latest version, 4.5, Flinders Bay, was released in June 2025 with enhanced stability and bug fixes. Future updates will incorporate AI-driven personalization to improve your viewing experience. Remember, factory reset is a last resort that erases all data. Always try soft reset first, follow prevention tips to avoid future issues, and keep your software updated for the best experience.